Today we are going to show you that how you will find the output of a transformer on a oscilloscope. Yani in today's experiment you will understand the waveform and you will see the waveform at the secondary side of a transformer. So you already know that transformer is working on AC voltage. So definitely at the output we will have a sinusoidal waveform. So we are here to connect this one is the primary side of a transformer and this one is secondary side of a transformer. So this one is our varic. So here we will connect the primary side. So one will come here and the other will go here. Hello. Next we have a oscilloscope. We will open a oscilloscope. I think there is no power. Now uh, it's okay. We have two no. This when this will go to ground and this will be to the base. So here we will connect this one. Yeah. And this one. No. So first of all, safety is very important. We will open this, turn on, we will increase the voltage and we will see waveform here. This one is channel 1. So for channel 1 you will press here. Also if you can press auto, it will give us two value, channel 1 and channel 2. But here we need channel 1 only. So we will turn it up, channel now channel 2. We will turn it up and we will turn channel 1 on. We will apply some voltage. You will see here that how it work. Voltage from the oscilloscope. So out input voltage we will see from here and out, output voltage from the oscilloscope. Let's start. So if you can see the voltage, it's give us a sinusoidal wave. Look, if I increase you can see so let's make it 250 now let's we will press major and major we will see but it will be better idea if you press this if five twice you will get all these value so you can see the peak value is 18 or ms value is 6.37 or something Peak value is 18, so if you divide this by under root 2, definitely you will get the same value of RMS. So it's peak to peak value. So peak to peak value is 18, and our peak value, I mean like, look, this one is from here to here, this one is peak to peak. So one division is 3.27 volts, so 1, 2, 3. So it seems like 9. So from peak to peak, it's 18 and only peak value is from here to here it's 9 so if we divide 9 by under root 2 we will get an rms value and it will be equal to this one 6.4 so this one is rms value this one is our high as i said before this one is low and all these things frequency is this one period rise fall width and all these things this one is duty and everything is here so from this we know that our transformer is let's see our input uh, first of all we need to see our input that how much input we apply so This one is the primary side, so at primary side, what is the voltage? It's 250. So at secondary side, we will see at secondary side how much it is like 6.4 yeah, 6.1 something. And also you can see here at 6.3 RMS value. 
so we can also see from the oscilloscope so this is the way that how you will use oscilloscope and how you will measure the output waveform of the transformer and how you will see the output waveform of transformer by using oscilloscope